Chef Ivan Flowers. So what we're gonna do today is an amaretto bread pudding. Now, I grew up in Brooklyn and bread pudding was a big deal. Bread pudding, rice pudding, chocolate pudding, all puddings. And with a bread pudding, you know, you can make it any way you want. So what we're gonna start with, half a cup of cream. <clears throat> I'm then going in with two eggs. I like to fold it in with a spoon instead of whisking it. I don't know why. I think I'm a little strange that way. I'm going to go in with a little bit of cinnamon, third of a cup of sugar, dried cranberries, and a little amaretto. So we make a nice mixture. The sugar dissolves quickly. Egg yolks are nice and rich. This, you know, it's just going to coat that beautiful bread. I am using some nice brioche, about a cup and a half. Use bread that's about a day old, so it has some structure when it goes into that cream. If you don't have bread that fresh, you can toast it a little bit. Now, what we're going to do is I've got a mold. This is oven safe. I'm going to put it into the mold and then I'm gonna go right into 350 degree oven for about 11 minutes. And there you have it, the bread pudding. Simple, it's become alive, it's expanded. A little hot, we're gonna take this mold off. Nice bread pudding. Now, we wanna, we wanna finish this. I'm gonna do a little sour cream or creme fraiche with rum. That's simple. So I have a full fat sour cream. I'll go on top, a nice dollop, and then I'm gonna finish with a little caramel sauce. Just a little bit, just for a little contrast.